Good morning, this is we want K21 Show Me Drones here with you again sharing this video that I put together showcasing all of my drones. The footages were taken at different locations throughout the Kansas City area. To take the videos I used my DJI drones, the original Mavic Mini, the Mavic Air 2, the Phantom 4 Pro, the DJI FPV and my latest acquisition, the Autel Evo 2 Pro 6K. Before moving further, with the video, I want to say, if this is the first time that you're visiting my channel, subscribe if you're interested in drones, action, cameras, tech, and how you can take full advantage of this awesome hobby in taking awesome videos and photos from high in the sky. The Evo 2 Pro is the greatest competitor to DJI prosumer level drones. The drone has a one inch sensor with adjustable aperture and the only drone capable of shooting at 6K 30 frames per second. There is no other affordable drone capable of shooting at 6K. DJI recently introduced the Air 2S and the drone can shoot at a 5.4K 30 frames per second, but no adjustable aperture, which is not a big deal unless you have to catch your shots with very detailed depth of field. The adjustable aperture is critical to control light coming into the sensor, but ND filters have proven to be of great help when taking videos and photos in bright days. Here I have my new EVO 2 Pro and the Mavic Air 2. The EVO 2 Pro was introduced during CES 2020 and at the time it was supposed to hit the market in February or March and it did not happen right away because of production placed on hold due to COVID-19. I placed a deposit for the EVO 2 Pro and canceled due to the drone not being available to consumers until May of 2020. I realized the delay for the release was not all tales fault, but I wanted to get a very promising prosumer drone, so I decided to get the Mavic Air 2 that was released in April of last year. That is why you see me with these two drones. The Mavic Air 2 made a huge bang when it got released with all the different features added to the drone, such as 48 megapixels, 4K at 60 frames per second, high dynamic range HDR, half an inch sensor, 33 minutes of battery life, and a new remote controller. The drone looks like the younger sibling of the Mavic 2 Pro, but with a higher frame rate when shooting 4K. The drone was considered for many the best consumer drone of 2020. Now let me tell you about the EVO 2 Pro. This drone is amazing. To me, there is no better prosumer drone in the market as of today. I watched many YouTube videos covering the EVO 2 Pro from recognized content creators like Billy Cow, Original Dole, Captain Drone, Dan Watson, Ken Heron, and others. And I made the decision of getting this drone and not the new Air 2S. The reasons are many for my decision, and there is, not, there is enough videos covering the EVO 2 Pro specs and capabilities, so I'm not going to mention all of them. Let's just say that 6K and 33 minutes to 35 minutes flight time and rock solid connection and stability in high winds is more than enough for me to have this awesome drone. I also wanted to break my streak of getting just DJI drones after all DJI controls the drone market and for good reason. And it had to do with how awesome the drones are integrated between hardware and software. The drones are easy to fly and often New drone enthusiasts are, you know, having a positive experience when flying the drones and falling in love with this great hobby. All right, my friends, this is all I have for today. I hope you find this video interesting and informative. And without further ado, here is all my drones video. I hope you like it. And speaking of that, if you like drones and tech, give me a like, hit the bell, so you can get notified new videos and subscribe to my channel so you can stay updated in any upcoming videos I will share in the future. Like I always say, this is Obi-Wan K21, show me drones and stay tuned because I will be back soon. Enjoy, take care and happy flying.